Hi, my name is Emily. I'm going to be performing the skill video patient education number two, prenatal precautions. I'm going to be a perfect school attire, badges, visible, no collars, no coat, nails, no jewelry. All right, to start off, I'm going to discuss uh, common foods that should be avoided during pregnancy. The first set is unwashed or pre-cut fruit and vegetables, um, unpasteurized dairy, oh, and don't eat cheese. This can lead to a mysteriosis, which can cause a miscarriage. Second set would be unwashed fruit and vegetables. And undercooked meat can lead to toxoplasmosis, which can lead to fetal blindness and fetal brain damage. Um, undercooked meat and raw or undercooked eggs can lead to salmonella poisoning, which can um, cause a miscarriage. You also want to avoid any fish containing mercury, as this can affect the baby the baby's uh, nervous system. High doses of caffeine can cause low birth weight and miscarriage. For over-the-counter medication, um, just want to avoid any of that during um, the first trimester if you can, as this is the time that the baby is um, at highest risk for any damage. Also, it's recommended to speak to your physician before taking any over-the-counter medication. Supplements. Of course, uh, prenatal supplements, folic acid, things like that are um, not only safe, but they're recommended. Um, if the patient, or if you, sorry, are having problems gaining weight, physicians worried about your weight gain, there are protein powders and drinks, supplemental drinks like Boost that are um, okay to take during pregnancy. There are medications that are strongly um, contraindicated contraindicated during pregnancy. Those are called teratogenic drugs. They can cause um, severe birth defects and miscarriage. And they are epileptic medication, retinoid medication, ACE inhibitors, ARBs, lithium, oral contraceptives, and warfarin. Um, three common environmental exposures to avoid. Extreme heat, such as hot tubs or saunas, saunas um, they can cause severe neural tube defects. Second one is cat litter boxes. This leads you to this exposes you to toxoplasmosis. As I said before, it can cause you know the um, fetal blindness and brain damage, but it can also cause um, stillbirth. Yep. Um, last one is radiation. So high dose x-ray can lead to miscarriage. All right, alcohol, tobacco, and substance abuse. Yeah, um, all of that needs to be completely avoided during pregnancy. Alcohol can lead to fetal alcohol syndrome, which can um, cause uh, growth abnormalities, mental disabilities, and abnormal facial features. Um, tobacco. So smoking, not only does it have harmful chemicals in it, but it has nicotine. Nicotine can cause permanent damage to the baby's lungs and um, brain. Both of those also are um, cause vasoconstriction, which lessens oxygen, decreases oxygen and nutrients to the baby. And for the mom, this can place her at risk for increased bleeding. Substance abuse. Um, Substance abuse for the baby that can be um, cause placental complications, um, severe birth defects, neonatal withdrawals. For the mom, this places her at risk for anemia, um, infection, and hepatitis. All right, travel for during pregnancy. If it's long distance traveling, it should be advised to speak to your physician um, to make sure there's no um, complications for your pregnancy. Reason being, sitting in, during um, travel is the main um, cause. It can lead to DVTs in your lower extremities. Um, ways to avoid that: get up and move around as you can, as much as you can. Wear compression socks. Stretch and move your lower legs, your ankles. No signs and symptoms of DVTs, and um, make sure you have adequate fluid. The safest time to travel is within the second trimester, as the first trimester can cause spontaneous abortion, third trimester hypertension, or preterm labor. Yeah. 
So preparation for travel. Um, you want to know your blood type. You want to um, avoid any uh, vaccines, such as like typhoid vaccine. Um, you want to avoid tropical islands or developing countries because that can expose you to the Zika virus from mosquitoes. Yes. All right. Um, dentist. Seeing the dentist during uh, pregnancy. It is highly recommended um, because you can issues during pregnancy. Um, you can la la la. Dental issues during pregnancy due to hormonal change. You, a, um, a pregnant patient can have um, increased infections um, due to diet and cravings. They that places them at risk for increased cavities. So the best time to go to the dentist is probably the second trimester. As the third trimester, you want to avoid laying on your back for long periods of time. Um, you want to avoid any X-rays when you're going to see the dentist. And procedures that are safe would be fillings, crowns, and anesthesia with epinephrine. And that's it. That concludes the professions video.